guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and Wellington. Can you say hi, baby? Uh, last time I was here, I, where was I? Oh, I had my recap of my Cinchy retreat. Hi. But I didn't tell you, so I took my friend here to the vet and just a quick update. He does have high blood pressure. They did a little blood pressure test on him. And so he takes some medicine every day and it's gonna help with his blood pressure. And he's definitely feeling better, I think. He's been much more frisky and he's been playing, which is nice. Hi, baby. Um, so yeah, I've got a new cup. I got this from my friend Teresa for my birthday and it says drink up Grinches. I've been wanting a Grinch, this is a Ray Dunn. I've been wanting a Grinch Ray Dunn mug and I have yet to find one. So I got one. I had a fantastic birthday and yeah. So now I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. And this is in no particular order, but there is a lot of newer stuff. Hi, newer stuff in here. Um, oh, I found one of the, the, they had these in a couple different, and it's just, I, I think they're calling them ornaments. They are. Uh, I guess you could put that on your Christmas tree, but I will, um, I just took off a tag. I probably will put this in a shadow box or my tiered tray, I think. And they had them in a couple of different patterns. And it's just a little sack with some stuffing in it. So I got that. Um, these are a repeat from last year for sure. But they make such great little impromptu like stocking type bags. They're great for like smaller gifts. But I love to just put, um, hi, sir. Can you not get in the bag? Thanks. I like to put some stockingy treats if I'm going to give somebody some of that and tie it off and add it to the outside of their bag or gift box. So I grabbed two, uh, the snowflake and the Christmas tree. There's a lot of Christmas in here. Okay. Hi. Hi. Um, I grabbed this garland and I feel like this is new. Maybe not. But it also could be used for ornaments, like six ornaments, but it is just Santa Garland. Like I am loving, oh, let's get that one fixed. Well, that one's backwards. Oh, there we go. And it's just six Santa heads. Isn't that everything? I know. I love it. I may even put that, okay, hi, we don't lick plastic, thank you. I feel like I have a toddler sometimes, not gonna lie. All right, let me put this away so he doesn't come over and lick on that. Um, I'm not buying a lot of signs, but I did find, I'm gonna need some help here. Anybody need a black cat? Can you please go? Thank you. Um, I needed these. This was an imperative. So this says, it's the most wonderful time of the year. This is in glitter, but there's not a lot of fallout. And this, like the house is 3D. And that is also glitter. But again, there's not a lot of fallout on this. And I love the plaid. I love it. I just think it's perfect. And it definitely looks like more than $1.25 if you ask me. And then they also had this one that says, may your days be merry and bright. And these two trees are like 3D. That one is not and glitter again. And it's on the faux wood background. And I just love these. I think they're great. And I like, um, sorry, my allergies. I like the, the plaid. I love plaid. I love plaid all the time. I'm not just talking about Christmas, but I just love all the plaids. Okay, now that Wellington went and to sit in his window seat, I can put the Christmas stuff in the Christmas bag. Oh, oh, we are gonna be having a new background soon. As soon as I can 
make some time in my basement. I think I'm going to set up a new video recording spot that I can leave permanently set up and then I could decorate and all that. So we'll see. Um, but I found nerds, nerds guys. I'm so excited. Grape nerds, sugar-free drink mix packets, and you only get six, but I did get three packages. I love grape drink mix. I love it. And I thought, well, there was three left and I'm just going to go for it. Did I mention I don't really have a ton of stuff here, but that's okay. Look at this bag. And these are the reusable shopping bags, tote bags, whatever they're going to call it. And they had them out this year. So you have the snowflakes. The bottom is just solid. And then this one has all the little creatures. Oh my God, look at this llama. And the bear and the sloth and the koala. And then it's the same on the back. And I love these for transporting. So not necessarily as a gift bag. However, they would work for that. But I love these for transporting. I have to do my thumbnail. Um, Christmas gifts. If I'm going to like a party or somebody's house and I have gifts for them, I love to bring them in a bag like this. Plus, if it's a place that if it's a place that I'm just dropping gifts off, then I leave the bag behind. If it's a place that I'm in, I am gifted things. Sometimes I bring those home with me in the bag. It's perfect. Um, oh, I grabbed these. These are every year. These are the Lindor Milk Chocolate Truffle Bar and the Caramel Bar. And these are fantastic stocking stuffers. Um, or if you do like the coffee mug full of treats or for coffee, you can put um, a couple of those in it. it. It just makes a great presentation and I love these bars for gifting. So uh, you'll see that I will start collecting candy for stockings and stuff like that. Um, also, same concept. I got the Blue Diamond and these are Extreme Cayenne Pepper um, Almonds. And I got these for a relative that I'm giving a gift to and this will go with their gift and it will go in the package with their gift. And I just love buying these little food treats and putting them in with things. Stockings, if you have like somebody in your life who loves hot food, that would be perfect. Um, and then I got, I picked these up. Guys, I'm dying. And this one opened, which is perfect. These are new this year, Hanging Silhouette Snowman Light. Now this one happened to have popped open, which is perfect, but they take batteries that I don't have, so I can't, uh, indoor use, warm white light, one piece, and it doesn't say what size batteries they take, but it looks like double or triple A. But anyway, so this is, it can hang on the hook or suction to a, well, a window, and then you light this, and it lights what the heck dollar tree who are you oh i'm so putting these in my windows this year probably up in my bedroom if i had to guess so this is obviously the snowman his was ripped open so i took him out but i might get another snowflake for my bedroom window so they match but that is the snowflake and if you do the snowflake you can leave them out all winter now they do take batteries and you do have to turn them on and off that's the one downside. And then I got a star. So either I will put these all in a window or um, something of that nature. If they'll go in a window or I'll hang them on my front porch. My front porch is covered. So even though it says indoor use, I can get away with that for sure. I think I'm allergic to my cats. I know. It is what it is. What are you going to do? I'm going to get allergy tests after the beginning of the year because they're getting worse. So I'm just trying to figure out what the allergen is. And yeah, not that I'm, if it's the cats, I can get shots. Um, I grabbed one more of these. I love these. I buy them all the time. I know I can wash them and I do, but sometimes they get pilly and gross and I'd rather for a dollar just toss them. Um, this is the drying mat, but I put my coffee maker on this 
and it keeps any mess from getting all over my counter, like dribbles and drips. And if I overspill when I'm pouring water and whatever. Um, so I got red for Christmas time. But I also have some black ones. I just buy them when I see them. Um, also for Christmas, I just grabbed a package of these little boxes. So you get, it looks like two of these long ones, which are like tie shaped. Yes, and three of the smaller ones, which would be great for any type of gift giving. Um, and this is a five piece set and I love the colors. I love this pink and mint for Christmas. And I knew I needed some small boxes because I ran out last year. Typically I shop up and all that stuff at the end of the season, but I didn't last year because I'm trying to use up what I have, but I needed some of that. So I got some of that. Um, I guess we'll stick with the Christmas theme. I buy these every year as well. If you do any kind of DIY, decorating, crafty stuff, these little bows are like perfect. You can just hot glue them or if you're doing ornaments, you can do, they have like the bread tie and I love them. And then they have the little gold or silver bead in the middle. These are silver, silver bead in the middle and I think these are just perfect accent for crafty things or small packages and I buy these every year I usually get one or two a year and I'll use them I will use them all on all kinds of crafty business even use them as um if you get the little Dollar Tree Christmas tree you can use those as ornaments or tie them onto the boughs of the tree absolutely um okay more christmas yes more christmas um hello christmas tree i think this is fantastic now um they sold these at target in the dollar spot last year i think for three dollars and they had them in the black and red buffalo check and these are stuffed like felt and then there is a um stick in the middle and then on a round base now as a crafter if you see these and maybe you don't love the christmas tree you can take the tree off and use this base this is a fantastic base for any seasonal thing because it the stick goes all the way to the tippity top so it will be that tall i mean i don't know i think this is pretty great it's it's very well seated in this what looks like a tinker toy but if you find Tinker Toys at like a yard sale or something, Dowel Stick and a Tinker Toy will do the same thing. But I loved that. And like I said, I'm going to have a new place to decorate. Um, downstairs, I have some bookshelves, so I needed some little trinkety things. Um, I just needed this in my life. This little elf I needed. I think it's a her. We're gonna pretend like it's a her because she has braids. It could be a him. We don't care. It could be a they. I don't care. Um, but adorable. Little elf. I don't think this is new this year, but it might be. I know I saw some repeat gnomes from last year, uh, but this is definitely getting put on display. And look at the little hair. It's just, no, you don't lick either. The only other one is licking plastic bags. Um, but this was just everything in my life. And I love the ears. So this will definitely get used in decor. Can you stop, please? Thank you. This is a different one, leaking plastic bags. Um, I grabbed this. I feel like they had this out as well last year, but I love this kind of stuff for my countertop in my kitchen. Like I would sit my sugar or my salt um, cellar on here, maybe my pepper grinder, or just sit it on the shelf in front of my coffee maker. I don't know. I could put my put it on my coffee station. Um, but I thought it was cute and I wanted to share it with you. And it's just tin. And it's not overly large. You could also use this if you're doing little cookie trays. This would be an adorable little cookie tray. Because it doesn't hold a ton. And you could just do like a little bit. So I grabbed that because. Oh, look at this. I need to iron it. It's wrinkled. This I know is 100% new this year and this will go on my front door. I mean, I'm not even mad about any of this. 
and it has the bells and the bells are just on. So if you want to change out your bells, you can. I mean, this is just everything. For $1.25, this is going on my front door and my cats will, and Luna dog will beat on, she will, she pats the bells when she wants to go outside but it's wrinkled and they are wrinkled but I think I can just give it a quick iron or like mist it with some moist with some water and let it hang I think it'll hang out just fine so I got that and it's just called a doorknob hanger and I got this I'm taking this tag off so you can see it and I'm pretty sure they had these last year as well um but we needed this hat, right? I mean, who doesn't need this headband? And then the last of the Christmas things, they also, these are new this year, just like the, ooh, just like the um, fall ones. These are for Christmas and they have warm wishes and it's the gingerbread. And I think I mentioned, I do, I'm going to do my kitchen in gingerbread men. So that is perfect. And this one, a lady told me at the Dollar Tree, what she does with these is puts them on her sink and puts her sponges and stuff in it. But you could also bake an individual small loaf of bread and gift the whole thing to somebody. Because I think that would be fantastic. Should this be my thumbnail instead? I mean, I'm wearing my Hocus Pocus t-shirt. I don't know. Look at my nose. It's all red. Anyway, these you can bake in. They're microwave safe. So if you do any baking, I would say get a couple. If you have like a neighbor. Oh, I can't with this cat. Like I will probably bring some over to my neighbor. Now, a couple things that are not necessarily Christmas related. And I don't have batteries for this. I don't think. I mean, I do, but I don't have them out. Yeah, this takes, I think it takes two, two double A batteries, maybe. It doesn't say. Anyway, these are disco lights. So fun in, in and of itself. But can you imagine, like, in my front bay window behind some decorations and have this lighting up or two of them going? I think these are going to be perfect for Christmas. You can also, if you do, like... If you have your little kids and you do the elf on a shelf or the Santa cam, that could make a fun Santa cam uh, because of this little sticker what comes off. This label will come off and it's just, I can't get it off because my nails, but um, you can just take the little black label off and put on there like Santa cam and then a couple batteries and let this thing go. I need to find, I think it's double, oh, it's three triple A batteries is what it takes. Three triple A. So if I remember, I will put some batteries in one and go in my bathroom and see how well they work. In my bathroom because I can shut the door and there's no light. It's an indoor bathroom, interior room. Yes, I have indoor bathroom. Um, and then they had, I'm sorry, ranch seasoning. What? I buy this at Trader Joe's for $3. So I got it for a dollar and 25 cents. Salt, buttermilk powder, citric acid, garlic powder, black pepper, uh, mono. It does have MSG, onion powder, parsley. It's an anti caking agent and it contains milk. So there's no thickener in here, which. Some of your ranch packets have starch in it, so that's why I can't have it, but this is just the seasoning, and I can have that. So I think that's pretty fantastic for like, you know, just like a ranch powder. And I know some folks put that on um, raw carrots. Instead of dip, they just put the powder on it. And then the last thing I got were these little makeup bags. And these are Kylie and Kendall. Kendall and Kylie. Those Jenner girls related to those Kardashians. Um, but I thought it was a fun, like, makeup. It's a makeup bag. Or you could use it for pens and pencils or your... Um, crochet hooks, knitting needles, and then it also I got it in this pattern with the flowers, which I really like. 
Um, but you can put anything in there. Craft, you can use your paint brushes in here. Really anything. I'm kind of surprised at the quality that they were probably selling these for more than $1.25. I mean, they feel like they were are worth a dollar, but I wouldn't pay more than that. But I think these are gonna be fun gift giving little baggies to put like maybe some makeup brushes and a gift card or something for my little cousin. I think she will enjoy these. And yeah, perfect. And that is everything I got. Uh, at the Dollar Tree this week. My stores are still kind of slow getting things out. Um, I do have a, a haul video coming up later this week on what I bought in London and brought home. And then I'll have one more video on my trip with some touristy, probably like some video set to some music, just showing you the different sites that I saw. So I hope you enjoy and I will talk with you later. Bye. Oh my goodness. This is fun. Ah, I highly recommend getting the disco ball.